Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel and now we're going to do the recording of the 31st of March and what does Godfather have to teach us in this? We're going to explore that. Supreme Godfather wants us to become Trikaldarshi, a master Trikaldarshi. That means we should understand the three aspects of time and then decide what kind of karmas do we want to do. So let's see that. Baba says, may you be master Trikaldarshi and know the consequences of every action before you perform it by being knowledgeful. Knowledge full god father comes down on earth and with the medium of brahma or adam gives us the knowledge of the beginning the middle and the end of this drama that means the complete drama if you are an actor and i am an actor we are on this earth as souls and actors and we don't know when this world started when the drama started who were the prime actors what happened in between when when the interval happened in between of this movie and when the end of this movie is going to come then you are a nastic and I am a Gnostic. That means we are atheist in simple terms. God says if you know God, you should know the creation. That means when it started, how it started, and when it's going to change. If you don't know this, then you're an Gnostic or an atheist, even if you're going to a temple or a church or a Gurdwara or a, a Masjid. So Godfather says if you know the creation and the creator, then you are somebody who believes in God, who loves God. So then let's understand in details. May you be a Trikal, Master Trikaldarshi and know the consequences of every action before you perform it by being knowledgeful. Trikaldarshi children who know the three aspects of time, past, our previous births, present birth and the future births. What is going to happen? Trikaldarshi children know the consequences of every action before they perform it. They would never say it shouldn't have happened. I shouldn't have spoken out this way. I shouldn't have gone into lust. I shouldn't have been angry. I shouldn't have shown the ego. But it happened. No, they cannot say that. It shouldn't have, I shouldn't have said it, but I just said it. This shows that you did not know the consequence of the action, action and just performed it out of innocence, in bracket, ignorance. Ignorance of knowledge or of realization. Even after having knowledge, you can not come to a realization sometimes. When we have an experience and when we fall down, we have the realization of what God says and then we like, okay, this is what God means. When we have an off mood because of doing a bad karma, then we realize why God wants us to not do that karma. Then God says, this shows that you did not know the consequences of the action and just performed it out of ignorance and innocence. It is good to be innocent, but you have to be innocent in your heart towards others not innocent in situations and action, actions that means i was innocent i didn't want to be angry but i became angry no god says that innocence is not going to work you can't be having wisdom and still be innocent it doesn't work together right be trikal darshi as you listen to everything and say anything when we are saying something when we are listening to something when we are interacting with people be trikal darshi if i'm going to act today in this manner, tomorrow or day after tomorrow or after a month or after a couple of years, I'll have to pay back for what I've done today. So be careful when you say something, when you act on something, when you listen to anything. You will then be said to be a saint, that is a great soul. So innocent is a saint soul. So innocent and wise at the same time. How do you do that? How do you become that is what we learn. This color or this method in Brahma Kumari is called the spiritual university with this function.